Hey y'all, welcome back to Yellow Texas. So here on the show, we never shy away from a good time, especially when it involves quality drinks made right here in Texas. So for our next destination, we are headed east of the Alamo City for a behind the scenes look into the rum distilling process and of course, taste some of the best rum in the whole entire state. So come along as we make our way to the infamous town of Gonzales. Located one hour east of San Antonio, Gonzales has a quaint small town charm, but with huge Texas ties. We are the birthplace of the Texas Revolution, and we are proud. We fired the first shot of the Texas Revolution. We celebrate, come and take it. And speaking of pride, how about tasting a spirit that is fully 100% Texan at San Antonio Distillery? Opening its doors one year ago, San Antonio Distillery may be young, yet packs a ton of history along the walls. So to get a backstory on how a rum distillery ended up here, we met up with Keith. Gonzalez has some pretty interesting history. The first shots were fired against Santa Ana troops. Yeah. It was the Immortal 32, or 32 men who went to go defend the Alamo. And, and that's why Gonzalez is considered the birthplace of Texas freedom. Everything about this rum is Texas. It's our molasses is from Texas, from the Rio Grande Valley. It's all brewed right here, all distilled right here, fermented right here, and it's just a natural Texas product. So what happens when a family of farmers teams up with a family of distillers? A dynamite rum recipe. Basically, simplified. We uh, take molasses, we clarify it, add some sugar, water, and yeast, and then we ferment it. As it's distilling, the steam will rise up through the column, and then it will condense, and as it condenses, it'll come out here, and then this is the finished product of rum. Let's get ready to rumble! Okay, I'll stop. Whoa, I'm not gonna lie, this one's pretty damn good, if I can say damn on TV. Now I bet you're probably thinking, how do I get my hands on this homemade rum? Well, every year Gonzalez hosts a come and take it celebration to commemorate the first shot of the Texas Revolution. We celebrate the first weekend of October. It's all free to the public. Just great family fun for friends and everybody. Now that's a way to come and taste it. <sighs> this is so delicious, but I also think this is uh, about Enough rum I can handle for one afternoon, but I also think that it doesn't get much better than this. Texas rum with Texas ingredients in the birthplace of Texas Independent. I'd say, great day to be a Texan. Cheers, y'all. Interested in tasting a Texas rum with tons of flavor? Visit sarum.com. And speaking of the Come and Take It celebration, that's happening October 5th through 7th right here in Gonzales, Texas. And going on now through November 25th is the South Texas Corn Maze, great family fun in Hondo, Texas. Unfortunately, we are out of time here on Yellow Texas, but don't worry, a fresh new episode comes next week with more fun and adventures ready to be tapped into. So we're gonna say goodbye for now, but remember, it's a big world, so get out and explore it. You know what they say, you only live once, Texas. See y'all. Run, Forrest, run. Extra good luck. Ready, 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 <laughs> ready to run. <laughs>